Let's simplify the fraction 7 6. And here's how we do it. We're looking for another fraction that's equal to an equivalent fraction has the same value as 7 over 6. We just want to reduce it to its lowest terms. We want to simplify it. To do that, we need to find a common factor, something that goes into 7 and 6 evenly. Turns out the only thing that goes into both 7 and 6, the only factor, is 1. Divide 7 by 1, you get 7. Divide 6 by 1, you get 6. And that's what we started with, 7, 6. What that means is that this fraction, 7, 6, it's already simplified. We can't reduce this any further. Do note that 7 over 6, it is an improper fraction because the numerator, the 7, is larger than the denominator, the 6. So we could write it as a mixed number. Let's do that. So 6 goes into 7 one time with 1 left over. And we bring the 6 across. In the fraction 7, 6, that equals the mixed number 1 and 1, 6. You can check that. 1 times 6, that's 6. 6 plus 1 is the 7. And then we just keep the denominator the same. But in answer to our original question, the fraction 7, 6, we can't simplify this any further. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.